Today we are playing the Medieval Color Legacy Challenge. This is the light green generation and last time we got quite a bit done. I actually sat down and wrote down goals and we achieved them, so that's great. We're gonna try to do that again. <laughs> so for this little episode, I would like for us to purchase another business. I've got a lot set up, but I'll have to actually build it. But basically they need another business because they need three fully functional community lot businesses. And what I mean by fully functional is that they have a manager that manages it without the Sims needing to stop by the lot kind of thing. So I would like to start the next one, which will be pottery. I would also like to purchase at least one new aspiration item since we have to unlock all of the aspiration awards. So I'm not sure what item that will be. I'm guessing Mare will be the one purchasing it since he's got quite a bit going on. But we've got the Noodle Soother, Elixir of Life, Whether or not. Love tub, cool shades. I don't think I put any in anybody's inventory. No, I didn't. Okay, so we could purchase then. We don't have a money tree yet. We don't have that. Um, we don't have the thinking cap or the kibble of life. Oh, we do already have the goose. I'm counting it. We have it. It's fine. I was tempted to make them buy it again, but I feel like it's fine. I'm not going to make them do it again. It's on the lot. They also have one of these as well. So yeah, we're doing pretty good. I'm not sure what we're going to unlock, but I would like to unlock one of them. I don't honestly know if Merrick is going to come back because I had him at the business just grinding away. And... I don't know if he's gonna come back this episode because I have a mod that like it's community lot mod time thing. I don't know, words are hard. And so he might not be present. The last thing that I want to achieve is I would like for Armand to marry Beth at the end of this round. You might have forgotten about Beth, but a reminder, one of the requirements of this generation is to have an arranged marriage and to be enemies to lovers. And Beth Bride is choice so we are her enemy now we're gonna have to work on getting her to like us not to get married there is an a special arch that I have so they can get married no matter what their relationship status is but it might be wise to at least try and befriend her a little bit but I also kind of like them the idea of them not liking each other for a while and just eventually coming to terms with it they're only supposed to have one legitimate child so that also will help if they don't like each other for a while. They're not going to be like Veronique and freaking Merrick taunting me going, we might have a baby. We might do it. I'm like, don't you do it. So yeah, that was a long winded, 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 winded. Words are hard. That was an intro. Let's just, let's just get started. Shall we? So Veronique is not going to be able to clean that because there's already a cat in there. We're also steadily earning the money that we need, but then again, we keep having to buy things like community lots. So it might be a while until we get the 250,000 simoleons. But I, ha I have faith in our little family. We've got all of the animals, I believe, now have jobs. Yes, everybody's got a job. Hopefully earning quite a bit of money. I don't know what level Daisy is, but... Veronique also has a job. Like, we're all just working away. Armand, you could stand to be awake. I also haven't figured out the slowdown issue. I did put in the, the cheat to have it, like, pop up and be like, hey, this is what's wrong. And so far, it's nothing that's fixable. So we're just going to have to deal with a little bit of slowness and I'm not going to get enraged about it. I, I will not. I am angry about it, but I'm not going to be angry. I think it's an item on the lot. Like that's what I feel like is going wrong. 
but also they're not telling me. So I don't, I don't know. Also, I need to take at least one screenshot because I will forget. I'll forget, and then I'll be upsetty spaghetti. I was gonna change her sleepwear, but she was orange, Jen. She can keep it. All right, where are the cats at? Can we train some cats? Cinnamon, where are you? Cinnamon is sleeping. Okay, well, orange. Orange is sleeping. Who else did you wanna get a promotion? Nutmeg. Nutmeg, what do you need? Nothing, of course. All right, Cinnamon, I choose you. You need to learn how to speak, so that's what we're doing. So I don't know why, but I've got It's a Hard Knock Life stuck in my head and it just won't go away. It just won't go away. And I haven't even, it's not like I heard that song recently. It's not like somebody even remotely said Hard Knock Life towards me. That's just what's happening. And I don't understand why the radio in my head is so weird. Before it was a RuPaul song for just weeks. That's just the way of it. All right, are you gonna wake up anytime soon? I also realized apparently he didn't make out with Christy. Very unfortunate, but we can we can work on that. He's still not best friends with her. They woohooed, but they're not best friends. Also, I'm participating in an auction right now, and kind of in a little bit of a bidding war. I'm trying not to because it's like such a mistake. You don't you don't do that, especially these online ones. Like you set your maximum and then you don't look at it. If you get it, you get it. But it's like a little acorn purse thing. It's like real tiny, but if you open it up, there is a thimble inside of it. And it's from the 1920s. I don't need this thing. I, 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 don't. I don't. I really, really in no way, shape or form need it, but I like want it. So I'm just watching it and watching it and watching it and it's it went over my high bid and now I'm just like upset about it <laughs> again I don't need it but I just like want it really badly it's an acorn and there's a thimble and it's very cute okay oh geez oh y'all are going to work everybody's going to work but not Meg okay all right major are you going to work major go to work I'm gonna go clean that cat bed because I know it smells. Also, I'm officially going to start trying to learn how to knit today, so wish me well. Wish me luck because I am concerned. But I really want to make a sweater. I just have this insane desire to make this very specific sweater. And someone made the mistake of telling me, oh, that's actually like one of the easiest beginner projects that you could do when learning to knit. And I was like, oh no. <laughs> so I'm going to practice, I have practice yarn. I got it for free. I went and got, it's called the Barrister's Bookshelf. I picked it up off Marketplace and the lady asked what I was going to do with it. I'm like, oh, I'm going to put fabric in it. And she's like, oh, do you do other things? Like, yeah. And so she just gave me a bunch of yarn and like, I think crochet needles, I have to look at them, from like the 70s, and I was like, cool, that's useful to me. So I'm going to practice with that yarn before I use my actual pretty yarn that I got for the sweater. I don't know if I've already said it or not, but I'm making the sweater from Wheel of Time season one that Randall Thor wears. It's like, he's just like wearing like a blue cloud sky sweater, and it's so cute, and I want it, so... I'm going to make one because I can't find one that is acceptable to me for sale. And I've picked out a second sweater for if I happen to like making sweaters and knitting. Uh, only murders in the building. There's a sweater that's like very much a Monet painting, so I'm going to make that as well. If if I like it. If I don't, I'm not going to buy more yarn. I'm not going to invest in being a knitter. Are you just gonna take the newspaper? Okay. Veronique, come on. Okay, we got one cat. We need another cat. There we go. I don't know where that accent came from or why I decided to do an accent. 
sad, but I did. Things happen. Things happen. I also want to say I'm very proud of the beagle, because he had an accident yesterday, but today he's been pretty good. He's been out and about, so I haven't had to, like, watch him. I still don't think he grasps the concept, but, like, I'm trying. Every time I catch him, like, go potty outside, I try to be, you know, real positive and reward him and just, like, go over the top. And then anytime he goes inside, I'm disappointed. That's right, you're not supposed to stick their nose in it or you're not supposed to, like, punish them. But I'm like, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I've tried everything, every single thing on the internet. I did get special cleaner though because I was using the enzyme cleaner because it's like, yeah, that's what you're supposed to use. And then I read something that's like, no, that doesn't actually help. So I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and cut because like there's nobody here. And when they come back, we will see them. Alrighty. Everybody's apparently miserable, but we've got some money coming in. Love that. We've still got our newspaper. That's that's a choice. Hey! Promotions? I mean, it's not important that they get promotions, other than money is nice to have. But look, we, we have a hundred thousand small leads. Words are hard. Let's have a cold. Not cool with that. But let's go ahead and purchase the next community lot. Yes, I'm eating a jelly bean. No, I'm not going to apologize for that. I forgot. I was eating them while we were paused, and I know it's loud, but like, jelly beans. They're not just any jelly beans, they're sweet tart jelly beans, because I'm special. Alright, um, I need to take care of the cow dung in the pasture, please. Thank you. Come on, Veronique. I know that this is your favorite part of the day. Oh, we're out of pet food. Come on, Curlicue. Oh, the slowdown is real. I just wish the cheat would tell me what it was. That's all. That's all. It's not like I added any new I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. No. I like this grass, but unfortunately it gets in the way. <laughs> Like can't pick up the things that you're trying to pick up. No, there we go. And it's so good, so it's very disappointing that half the time I'm like, well, oh, well, I can't pick it up. I can't even pick that one up. Are you? Eating me. Why not? What is in the way? Nothing is in the way of that one. What are you doing? Who hurt you? Who said that this is fine? Fine. That's fine. I'm not angry about that at all. Behavior game. Right, Armand, are you? Did you just motion deny me? Real estate. Purchase community lot. Yeah, I think he did. I think he just flat out went, mm, no. Pottery. Pottery, pottery 
barn. I forgot that I called it that, but that's great. All right, let's just go ahead and send him there. I wanna just get it set up and get employees hired, which reminds me, phone. <laughs> Excuse me. It's like a weird hiccup. You need a phone, my dude. Yelling. He wants everyone to know he's unhappy. Why are you unhappy, Orange? Alright, buddy, let's go to your new lot. Where's walked a lot? Why can't you walk a lot? Oh, probably because Merrick is off in his merry little way. We can't go nowhere. Okay, not ideal, not ideal. Cool. Well, but I want Merrick to be here for the wedding. I was gonna say we could just do the marriage. I'm gonna go ahead and play forward until Merrick comes home. I think that's the best course of action here. Okay, the frustration is real. The game did crash. We're moving past that. <laughs> Merrick, is finally here and as you can see I've put up an arch and as you can also maybe see Beth happened to walk by which is perfect because it's time to marry Beth. Now just a few things to touch on. I did just kind of cheap out and get a money tree because we needed to get an aspiration item and that's one of them. I do also have a list of the aspiration items we need. There are one, two, three, four, five, six more. Go through here so we do need the aspiration aspiration changer which is the renew you sensu orb i just put aspiration changer because i did um we will need smart milk kibble of life the energizer the thinking cap and the sit back everything else so a lot of the bigger ticket ones we've still got left which is fine it's fine it's fine not worried about it. I'm not thinking about it. I'm just checking that off the list. We did purchase the pottery barn thing, but we couldn't go because Merrick wasn't present. So we'll go there next time. Technically, we just needed to purchase it. Side note, this is now stuck forever and I'm very upset about it. So yeah, we purchased the pottery barn. We will run it next time. Maybe Beth can run it. But for now, I think it's time. It is time for us to marry our dear, dear Beth. I have been having them try to talk to each other and just see if we can improve that relationship at all. It has been going pretty well. Yeah, we're just marrying Beth. Everybody else has to stay away. We're phasing through horses. It's fine. But yeah, it's when they talk to each other, they do really like each other. It was actually hard to get them to be enemies, so... Yeah. I'm also gonna have to figure out why this lot is going so slow. It has to be tied to an object, so I'm just guessing that I've got some high polygon objects. That statue makes me think that maybe that is it. And there's also like some chairs and things like that, but at the same time, like I feel like sometimes you'll look at something and you're like, oh, that, that, that's high. I bet that's high poly, and it's not. And then, you know, you'll go to something else, and you're like, there's no way. There's no polys there. Where are the polys? I don't see them. And it will be incredibly high poly. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I know that I really don't want to mess with it. I'm also kind of frustrated because it feels like it wasn't happening on the earlier episodes of this. So it's like, what did I add something? Because I don't feel like I did. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's just let's just get married to Beth. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. She's still in yellow because she was originally made for a potential yellow gen spouse, and it just didn't 
she was not the chosen one. And I wasn't gonna like you to pick from that pool of brides and grooms, but they're there and I like them. So <laughs> oh, we're marrying into money, but Beth is so proud. You know what, good for you, Beth. Good for you. If you have to marry Armand, who is kind of difficult, like, yeah, of course I want you to marry for money and be absolutely happy in doing so. I support you. I also support her and hopefully give it us some non-Kenton looking kids. That's also why I picked her, is her face is so different. I thought maybe Merrick would do it, but I, Merrick wasn't enough. We needed to add in Beth and hopefully Beth will give us what we need. Okay. Waiting for the pop-up. Um, okay, I think the second, because this is actually asking about last names. I think it's the second one that I wanted. No, it was the first one. Oh well, I can fix that. I can fix that. I'm gonna fix it right now. I will forget. Where is my sim thing? There you are. Okay, so, um, what's it even under? Names. Uh. Okay, you know what? I will fix their names off camera, you don't need to see it. But hey, we have achieved our goals again. I'm very proud of that, especially because this was not the easiest thing to do with the going super slow issue that I have. I saw something else that said potentially like, maybe the cows are doing it because they move. I don't think it's them though. I'm I'm wondering if it's like this statue, maybe those plants. Uh, what else we got that's kind of, you know, the chairs. It could be any of those decorative items. I don't know. Like I said, I really don't want to have to go through and wish there was a tool that could just be like, hey, this is high poly. Hey, this is high poly. But sadly, we don't have such a thing. So I don't know. I'll figure it out. But yeah. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please do give it a like. It really does help. And I'll see you in the next one.